What is going on, everyone? Welcome to another episode here in the beautiful country of Nepal. Today, we are in Dulikel, a city not so far from Kathmandu. Uh, more of like a village, actually. As you can see, I'm leaving the resort area and I'm going to head to where the locals are because if you know me, you know that I am not a resort dweller. That is the resort over there and we are now heading over to the central area, the market area of Dulikal. Hello, namaste. How are you, brother? Good? Which way is the market? Market. Dulikal market. Is this way? Market, yeah. Okay. This way. Okay. Shukriya, bye. Thank you. All right. So we're going to head over to the market uh, here in Dulikal. Just kind of experience the city. It's not a big city. It's a pretty small, relatively small city. Uh, I guess you could even call it a village or a province. Hello, sir. Namaste. And I'm going to show you guys what the beautiful city of Dulikel, uh, what the beautiful city of Dulikel looks like. I'm excited to discover it for myself and show you guys as well. But such a beautiful, peaceful, serene feel here in Dulikel so far. Some of the houses and stuff you see along the walk here are just so beautiful. They're so colorful. Very like high houses, vertically built. And the blues and the greens and the pinks and the different colors that you have are just beautiful. Namaste. How are you, boy? Tigo? Tigo? Yeah, Dulikel, right? Ah, Dulikel. Uh, uh, shops or is, is the is Yambe? Ah. Okay, thank you. I just asked them where to go because I'm still trying to figure out exactly where to go. I think you just go straight though. Seems like we're entering some kind of civilization here. Hello, namaste. <laughs> Another thing that I have to say is that the weather is a lot nicer here as well. You really get um, a nice breeze up here in the mountains. It's definitely uh, a tougher terrain to walk because we are high up in altitude. Namaste! These guys are just looking like, what is this guy talking to? But yeah, definitely uh, the weather is a lot nicer here than Kathmandu. The air is a lot more fresh. So, oh look, approaching some kind of gate. I think this leads to like some city-ish area. Let's see. Look at this, there's like a random little park here to do some workouts. Look at this, you can do some workouts here. Seems like there's some shops here also. Namaste! How are you brother? Tik Tok? Very good. Alright, I have no idea where I'm going. What's this? Namaste! How are you, brother? Tick tock. What is it? Kana? Ah, oh, Kana. It's for food. Okay, I will come back. Thank you. Okay. Konsa Kana hai yaha pe? Rice. Momo? Momo. Ek cheez pata hai? Ah, ye, uh, is, is, uh, ye kya naam hai iska? Iska naam Dulikel. Dulikel. So this is also... Kabri Jilla. Achha, achha. Kabri Jilla. Kabri Jilla. Kabri Jilla. Okay. So this is also Dulikel, but it's a village called Kabri Jilla. Kabri Jilla. Okay. Thank you. Hello. Namaste. How are you? I'm just making a video about Dulikel. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Okay, guys. So, thank you. All right. So, I'm gonna go down this way and see where we go where we end up here wow we are literally in the middle of nowhere here in nepal just walking through this random village i wonder how old these houses are you really don't see architecture like that anymore
Got the backdrop of mountains. See people just working. These look like rice, uh, rice plantations actually. Like a mini rice terrace almost. <clears throat> this house has uh, the four rings, like Audi, Quattro. no idea where I'm going guys just take this walk with me and hopefully we run into something interesting because like I said I have absolutely no idea where I'm going to end up Namaste, Namaste. how are you brother I'm good, fine. very good um, where are you from Dulikel no I'm not from here oh, okay where are you from I'm from Bhaktapur Bhaktapur yeah. where is that it's close to uh, Dulikel? Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I just got here to Dulikel. I'm making a video <laughs> about... Yeah. Where are you going from? I'm from the US. USA. Yeah, yeah. So what, what is special about Dulikel? Do you know? Uh, What's the special thing? I don't know. Hmm. I'm also new here. You're also new. Okay. I think the mountain is very beautiful. Mountain is very beautiful. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah, forest also are good for this. Beautiful. Yeah. And these are like rice, rice for yeah, rice, yeah, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's the rice. It's like a rice plantation. Yeah, plantation. Okay. Very nice. So is that the main thing that people grow here? All of this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the crop. It's maize? Maize. Okay. Nice to meet you, brother. What's your name? My name is Nimalama. 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 Yeah. Nice to meet you, Maya. Yeah. Maya. You watch YouTube? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you can watch my channel actually. Watch your channel. This is my channel. Subscribe. Okay. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Okay. All the best. Bye bye. Thank you. All right. So, people are pretty kind here as well. I've noticed. Um, but that's been my experience here, mostly in Nepal. People are really kind. You know, if you approach them with good energy and, and kindness, they they give you. They reciprocate it back. Namaste. Okay. All right. This is how people live here in this village. They survive off crops, planting, forestry, and there's a lot of building going on around here. You can see um, a lot of these hotels and resorts are being built here. I think the city is on the come up with the tourism for sure. So, but I don't see a lot of vloggers here. Once again, if you watch my channel, I always try to cover things that, you know, not every single vlogger is doing. Yeah, so these are rice terraces as you can see there's levels namaste how are you brother kaise ho tik kaam kaam kar rahe ho ye kya hai chawal 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 pehla dal pachi chawal ah chawal rice ah where is the town dulikel dulikel ka hai city yahan pe सीधा यहाँ से रास्ता नहीं है अच्छा तो तो यहाँ से जाना पड़ेगा ऊपर जाके फिर ऐसे यहाँ से नहीं जा सकते जा सकते ओके थैंक यू ओके राइट सो ही सेड देर इज अ वे दिस वे बट इट्स अ ट्रेचरस रोड सो वी हैव टू जस्ट फाइंड आउट एंड सी हाउ इट इज um i'm gonna try to see if i can make it through but it's a very muddy road as you can see and wet oh look at this chickens random chickens namaste how are you tico tic tac <laughs> oh wow all right yeah this road is very treacherous guys very wet i have no idea where i'm going but I think I can go up that way. Let's see. Let's see if I can get up through here. Oh man, this is wet. Whoa, my feet are sinking in. Okay, let's see. Oh, this is crazy. <laughs> Guys, don't try this at home. Don't be like me. Be smarter. Get a job. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love this. Oh wow. Look at this view. I think I have to go this way. I feel like a mountain goat climbing the mountains. Oh wow. All right. Guys, 
think I'm lost. But I'll find my way. Can I come this way? Can I come? Yeah? Oh snap. Alright. This is pure dirt. These guys are working here. And I am wearing Crocs. Not the best shoe for this. Oh wow, look at this. What's this? Road? RCC. Huh? RCC. Ah, okay. Look at this. Dog. Ah, look at this guy. He's picking up heavy stones. Yes. Both strong. You are very strong. <laughs> strong man. Okay. Namaste. Can I come this way? Okay. Okay. Let's see. How am I going to get through this wet dirt? All right. It is. It is what it is, guys. Look at this. My crocs are sinking in. All right. I think I can go this way. Huh? No. <laughs> Do like this way? Yeah. Do like Like this? Yes, yes. How are you, boss? Namaste. Namaste. How are you? Tick? Tick, sir. Tick tock. Okay. And what are you making here? What are you making? I'm a wall. 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 I'm a wall. I'm a wall. It's a wall with the stones. Acha, to phir mitti nahi aayegi niche. Nahi aayega. Acha, this liye ab ye bana rahe hain. Yes. Okay, very nice. Look at this guy's beautiful. Rice Ami, ani ro pahar ko Nepaliyo. Ani dunga bogsa ya exotic dunga ano mile bogi ko. Ab both strong hai. Mon, achi nahi. Ha. Look at this. Ani pahar ko manche. Hey, hey. Main nahi aaye. Dekh nu bani. Chik cha. Main try karu. I try to get it. I try to get it. I try I can pick up the small one. That's what I want. I want to I want to get I that's difficult guys these guys are doing this all day lifting heavy rocks that's hard work both Maria okay bye thank you all right okay bye wow that's tough work man walking through the dirt like that all day picking up heavy stones I can't do that Anyways, let's go find the town. Hey man, everybody's just working hard here. Manual labor. This is how the village runs. People just work hard. This guy's digging dirt. Namaste. People are building. I have no idea where I'm going. See, these people are planting this wall. See this? Namaste. <laughs> See, they're actually laying, and then she carves it out once he puts the thing on. She carves it out and makes it look all neat like that. That's the rough. Amazing how they work here. <laughs> hello. Hello, hello, how are you? I'm asking, what is special about this place, Dulikel? Beautiful temple. Beautiful temples. Where? Kahe? Hazar City. Hazar City, Naranthan. Ah, okay, okay. We have to go see the beautiful temples. Apparently, this place has beautiful temples. Dulikel. Parit? Parita Kendra. Parita Kendra. Kendra. Parita Kendra. Okay, that's a beautiful temple. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Namaste. Namaste. Bye bye. <laughs> bye, -bye. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, so I'm just talking to locals, trying to figure the lay of the land out. Man, this is so interesting, guys, just walking through this village. This is just amazing. Seeing how people work, how people go about their daily lives. You know, coming from this Western countries, like we don't know this life. I mean, I guess some people, like in America, maybe if they live in a rural area, they probably understand this life more than I do. You know, I grew up in New York and New Jersey, so I'm not really used to this kind of village lifestyle, so it's very interesting. 
very interesting to just walk around and see how things work. Alrighty, so now, as you can see, I'm entering the city area. So this area is definitely more uh, of the city vibe you get. As you can see, there's shops and things. Hello, doggy. Cute little dog. Namaste. How are you? Is this your shop? Yes? Uh, you make juice? Yeah. Fresh juice? Uh, which juice can you make? Watermelon. Okay, mm -hmm. I will do one apple and pineapple mix, please. Is this your baby? So cute. Yeah. So cute. How old? How old is the baby? Six months. Six months. Wow, amazing. So beautiful. All right, guys. So we're gonna get a juice here in a, a local place, a lo local juicery here. As you can see, they have fruits. Some fresh fruit juice always does the trick in this warm weather. How are you, bye? Good. Yeah. Tick tock. <laughs> so, ma'am, you are from Dulikel? Yes, I'm from Dulikel. Uh, this is my first day in Dulikel. Uh, how yeah. Did I do? So far, it's beautiful. Yeah. It's very, very. The mountains and everything is very beautiful. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What What do you say is special about Dulikel? Uh, it's but peace. Yeah. Peace. peace. Definitely, yeah. More than Kathmandu for sure. Yeah. Because <laughs> in, in Kathmandu, it's uh, like very quite noisy. quite noisy, yeah. But here you definitely feel the peace. <laughs> I'm making a video for YouTube about this city. Both are very city very <laughs> I'm practicing my Hindi. Ab Hindi bolte? Ne? Sorry, main Nepali ni bolta. Sorry. A lot of people in Nepal actually do speak uh, speak Hindi, but um, it depends. A lot of times you'll run into people who don't, and um, yeah, you know, it's like that. It's 50-50. And then the good thing is a lot of people do speak English as well, so that's nice. What's your name? My name is Silpa. Sil Silpa. Silpa. And this is your shop, huh? Yeah. How long have you been here? How long has uh, the shop been here? It's five years. Five years. Very nice. So business is going good then. Yeah, nice. <laughs> hopefully it grows more and more. Uh, hopefully. <laughs> so guys, if you come to uh, uh, Durlikal. Durlikal. You have to come support Silpa's business. And the name of the business is what? Uh, Afsan Fresh Juice and Lassi Center. Afsan Fresh Juice and Lassi Center. Make sure you support, guys. And Lassi is quite good here. And the Lassi is good? Yeah. Okay, I, next time I have to try the Lassi. Yeah, Today we'll try juice because it's so hot. It's going to be nice, you know, to have the fresh juice. But next time I will try your Lassi. Yeah. So she puts it in there and then the juice just comes out of here like that. Wow, look at that. You should keep the filter on to keep all the to get all the little particles out. So 160 for a fresh fruit juice guys. 160 is like if I was gonna calculate it for you in dollars, it's probably around maybe one dollar. Just a little bit of salt. Just a little bit. Can you put it in a takeaway? Do you have takeaway or no? no? Okay, no problem. I will drink it here. I will drink it here. No problem. So yeah, uh, 160 is like a, a dollar. So, or a little bit more than a dollar. And this is the juice. Cheers. Very good. Let's give it a taste test. Ah, so fresh. So good. Thank you, Sidra. I'm going to sit down and drink this. How can you go wrong with that? A fresh fruit juice in this beautiful city. I'm going to sit down and drink this juice here. Juice is done, guys. I'm gonna pay the nice lady. Thank you so much, Silpa. Yeah. It was very yummy. No problem for the change. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. All the best. And bye-bye, baby. <laughs> All right, guys, so nice experience getting some fresh juice. Now let's head a little bit more in and see what else we have here. Maybe we can grab a little bite to eat on the way. Namaste, bro. How are you? All right. That's interesting. A lot of places to get food here as well. Very cool looking city. Very old school. 
Namaste. How are you, brother? I have a question. Where is some good food in this area? What do you want it? Momo. Good egg. Momo. Momo, we do have Momo. You have Momo? Yeah. Who has the best Momo? Best Momo. Yeah. Best you have to try. Okay, let's try then. You can try. Which, which, uh, which Momo do you guys have? Uh, buff Momo. Buff Momo? Momo. Chicken Momo. Buff Momo. Buff Momo, buff momo okay. and Chicken Momo. Buff Momo. Okay. Let's do Buff Momo. How much is a Buff Momo? 100. 100? For how many pieces? 10 pieces. 10 pieces. Okay, let's try some Buff Momo then. Okay. Okay, guys, we're going to try some Buffalo Momo from these nice people here. Okay. And we're going to give you a rate review, an honest food review. Okay, okay. What is the name of your restaurant? Huh? This is the restaurant that I'm at. I'm going to try some Momo, of course. The most common food in Nepal. You have to try Momo. And we're going to give you an honest food review. Who's the owner of this restaurant? She's the boss. Yeah. You're the boss? Yeah. yeah. Uh, what's your name? Kavita Thapalli. Huh? Kavita Thapalli. Oh, that's very difficult. K-B-I-T-A. Kavita? Kavita? Thapalli. Thapalli. Yeah. So this is Kavita Thapalli and this is her restaurant. Yeah. And what kind of food do you have? Momo? What else? Tomin. Tomin. Chia. Chia. Hana. Tali. Tali. Hana. Hana. Ah, rice. rice. Yeah. Okay, very nice. So they have many different kinds of food. But we're going to try the buffalo momo. Very good. And you are also the owner. Boss. Boss. Yeah. Boss one, boss two. Yeah. But wife is always big boss, no? Yeah. Wife, husband, no. Wife, husband. Yeah, wife is big boss. No. Wife, yeah. yeah. You know, when it's a family business, they always take pride in it. So let's sit down and try some food. Do you come here a lot to eat? Yeah. Yeah? In front. Oh, you work here? So. That is my shop. That's your That's shop? My store. Oh, okay. So you own the paint store? Yeah. Oh, okay. So everybody comes to you for paint? Not everyone. Not everyone? Not Guys, everyone. you need to come. If you need paint, you have to go to him. What's your name? My name is Kishan Shrestha. Kishan? Yeah. Nice to meet you, Kishan. Yes, thank you. And today is my first day in... I'm here to have a tea. Oh, very nice. Do you like to have a tea with me? Uh, chai? Yeah. Uh, I just had a juice. Juice? Yeah, yeah so I don't know. Here? What kind of tea? Uh, milk tea. Milk like tea? tea yeah. milk okay, tea. let's have one milk tea. So yeah, uh, can you tell me something? Are you from the city of the... the yeah, I'm from the city. Dulika. Yeah. Uh, you were born here? Yeah. What's... Brother, what is special about Dulikal? For the people who are watching, can we tell them something special about Dulikal? Yeah. Uh, Dulikal, the main thing in Dulikal is the climate. The climate. Yeah, the weather is very beautiful here. It is you really. You cannot find it all over Nepal. And the air is very clean. Yeah, very clean, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's what I was telling you guys before. One thing about this place compared to Kathmandu is the air is so much cleaner. And it's not so far away. Only one, one and a half hour from yeah. Kathmandu. Yeah. But once you get here, you really do feel the change in climate. You can have a very good food here. Good the food? Newari food. This is a Newari town. Yeah. You What's the name? Uh, this is a Newari town. Newari? Town. Town. Newari city. Newari city. Here we have many cultural uh, events, cultural places. Okay. Uh, where you can enjoy a lot. Okay. Yeah, we have very variety of uh, fooding, Newari fooding also. Okay, okay. Very tasty. And uh, what is variety. the what is like the common food here to common eat? Common food to eat. You can have a chola. Chola? Yeah. Okay. You can have a chola and chula. Chola. Yeah. Okay. Very nice. Yeah. We have so many uh, temples. Temples. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we have so many parks here. A lot of parks. Parks. I s I was walking through the hiking trail here. Yeah. There was one. Yeah. There yeah. are so many hiking sites yeah. also. Mm -hmm. uh, we have so many. Events in here, okay. uh, yeah, occasionally organized. Okay. Yeah, uh, like uh, we have festivals. Festivals. Yeah, festivals. We have various of Jatra. Okay. Yeah. So you're proud. You're proud yeah, to be proud. from. Yeah, yeah. I'm very proud to be here. That's yeah. awesome. We are also organizer of some of the events. Okay. Uh, we oh, you also organize. Yeah, okay. we organize. Yeah, different uh, organize and organize different Jatras here. Okay. Yeah, very big. When do? When is there gonna be a festival? Uh, now you can now. Not, uh, not now, right? Not now, but uh, the festival season is just coming. It's coming. It's coming, yeah. Too bad we missed it. Yeah. Maybe next time we can catch the festival. And most of the people here are Hindu or Buddhist? Most of the are Hindus. 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 Yeah, Hindus. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I actually came here by taking a bus. Bus. Yeah. yeah. It was a very uh, like a local bus. Yeah. 
traveling in local bus is a bit tough here. It is. Yeah. No AC. It was very bumpy. Wild ride. Yeah. The road is under construction. Yeah, in the middle there is construction is going on. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense in this time. It, it was, but but it wasn't too bad because the journey is not so long. You know, it's quick. One and a half hour. I've taken some very long buses. Kishan treated me to some chai, some some milk tea. It's very hot, right? Very hot. Oh wow, it's spicy. They put a lot of spices in the chai yeah, as well. Tea is also very famous here. It is. Yeah. Wow. Some the Nepalese prefer to drink the tea, even in a sunny day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's definitely uh, milk. Milk tea is the popular, right? But this is like masala, masala tea, right? There is a masala. Yeah. You can definitely taste the masala. It has a very nice spice to it, actually. Thank you, Kishan. Thank you for the thank you for the chai, brother. Thank you so much. Yeah. Welcome, welcome. Please. How do you say thank you in Nepali? Kanebal. 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 Yeah. First, we say namaskar. Namaskar. Our guest. Okay. Waiver. Awesome. Come to us in that building. We say namaskar. We namaskar. By saying namaskar. Uh, and then we begin to talk. Okay. 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 Very nice. I like it here in Dulikel, man. The people are really, really awesome. The chai is really good too. So Kishan was just explaining to me how uh, this city came about. And how, how, what did you say? Yeah. Actually, this city uh, started when the people from Lalitpur yeah. and from Bhaktapur came by migrating here. here. Yeah. So originally people from Lalitpur and Bhaktapur yeah, came, yeah. they migrated here yeah. and they established this city. Yeah, yeah. And what time was that? Long uh, time ago, long, right? Very, very long ago. And uh, the uh, proof is that the festival we celebrate here okay. is the proof. Okay. Because uh, the people who came from Lalitpur celebrate their, uh, whatever they celebrate in that place, they started to begin to celebrate here uh, also. And they established the goddess okay, like okay. that. And from uh, Lal Bhaktapur as well. So it's a mixture. It's, it's a yeah, mixture it's a of mixture, people. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. But here, a variety of people are living here. Okay. This is. I have a question. So do the people from Lalitpur and Bhaktapur do they get they get along like family, and no problem? Like it's like the same or? Do they separate themselves? Uh, most of the people live in a joint family. Joint but, uh, family. Nowadays, uh, the single family is going. Single family. Yeah, it's single like everywhere in the world, everywhere right? In the world. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So it's, the old tradition is kind of changing a little changing, bit. Changing, it's a changing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's the reality of it. You know, I mean, everywhere in the world, old traditions are going away because of yeah. social media and all of this. Yeah. yeah so, but it's important to maintain tradition. You know, in some ways. But whenever we have a festival like this, we just get together, come together, celebrate together. Celebrate together. together. Okay. okay. Well, I, I can see that you guys are very like giving people. Like you have like a very inviting, welcoming yeah. kind of. Yeah. Yeah. Invite. Yeah. Now I have new friends. So guys, this is the Momo. So they give you some sauce, like a yellow kind of. I don't know what kind of sauce this is. It's a liquid sauce. It's like it's a. Like sauce. It's like Jol. We say Jol Momo. Yeah. Jol Momo is popular here. So you dip your Momo in there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So here we have the sauce. We got the Momos. And. Do you want to have chili? Uh, please. Yeah, I love chili. Thank you. You can first try and then you can add. So here is the beef buffalo Momo. They don't eat beef actually. In Nepal, we don't eat beef because that's a part of the religion. You don't. You don't. Yeah. Huh? Huh? My country is US. United States. Yeah. So we're gonna dip this into the sauce. You have to dip it in and then you take your butt. US way. Good huh? Very good. Good. Very yummy. You like that? If you're here in uh Dulikel, make sure you come stop here at this restaurant. What's the name of this restaurant? Kalinchuk. Sailing a Suri Rosen Hotel. Wow, that's too long. Uh, but yeah, you heard Kishan. The owners <laughs> from Kalinchok. 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 See, look, they also give you chili. And this the makes it spicy. Border district. Border district. Different district. Okay. Are we also close to India, right? The border? Close to India. Uh, I saw on the map, it's like the border is not too far. The border is not too far. Yeah. But uh, we have to go to the uh, Tora area. Okay. For that, yeah. So I can take this chili and put it in this? Tora? Tora? Okay. In here? 
Oh, okay. So you take the chili and put it in here. Now it's going to be a little bit spicy. Mm. It's very yummy. Very good. Do you, do you make this here? Yeah. Momo, you... Yeah. Oh, it's it's uh, not uh, not frozen. Already frozen. Yeah, it's, uh, they make it here. Yeah. Me and Kishan, we finished up. I couldn't finish the tea because I just don't need any more. But the Momo, very good. Kishan, my good friend. Thank, thank you, you so much. much. It was a pleasure speaking with yes. you. Um, and brother, how much? Okay. Kitna. Uh, how much? For okay, I will be paying for that. No, 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 please, no, no, please, no. Please, Let me take please. care of it. Let me take care of it. Please. Thank you so much. Uh, Momo, how much? Yes. 150 rupees. 150 rupees. Okay, okay so I have 1,000. You have change? Okay, thank you so much. So 150 rupees is like a dollar, a do little bit more than one dollar for 10 Momo, which is a great deal. Yeah? Yeah. You guys are all. You have to uh, find my channel on YouTube. It's Meyer Travels. This is the name. Super nice family. Thank you so much. You guys are very kind. Man, everybody here is super kind. Had a great meal. Those momos were really good, actually. I don't think I've tried bad momos yet. There's like levels to it, but I haven't tried anything too, like where I would say it wasn't good. How are you, brother? Namaste. What's this? I can walk here? It's a park. Ah, very nice. I can walk? I can go? Yeah. No problem? No problem. Okay, very good. There, there's a park here. That's what the guy was saying. This place is like known for parks and hiking trails, which we kind of just were on one before, as you saw. That was like a hiking trail in the making. But man, it's beautiful here, guys. You have to come to this city. It's so nice. Village. You get the little bit of the village life. You get the city life. You get it all here, really. I mean, you get the greenery, but you also get the buildings. You got good food. Oh man, I'm so satisfied. Oh, well, I don't know if they've kept this park up right. It looks like the walkway kind of ends here. But let's see, maybe we can uh, keep going and discover something along the way. Wow. Yeah, I think it kind of just ends here. But yeah, guys, um, I wanted to show you Dulekel. You know, I'm only here for one day and we're at the resort but i was like I, I don't like to just stay in the resorts i like to show you guys the reality how the locals live how the town runs what the locals eat what the locals drink and just everyday life you know and that's how you really discover a place not just by staying in resorts and i'm glad i came out here to the city it's about a 15 20 minute walk from where i'm staying but it was well worth it and i will do it again if I get the chance but anyways guys I'm gonna wrap this video up I think we've pretty much seen what this what the city and village offers with that being said guys remember continue to learn continue to grow and there is no growth until you leave your comfort zone I'm so glad I left mine to get experiences like this I'll see you guys on the next one peace out